MyFootballGamePlan.com, where football makes sense. I'm Memory Hunt, the czar of the playbook. Bring you our Western Athletic Conference Game of the Week preview between the Texas A&M Aggies and the Louisiana Tech Bulldogs. Now let's look at Texas A&M coming into this game, traveling down to Shreveport. They have to make sure they get off the field defensively. They can't allow Louisiana Tech to come in and have long sustained drives. That could be a detriment to what AM wants to do. The Aggies have to make sure they get off the field. Now the offense have to play with a controlled tempo, up pace, controlled tempo, similar to what Houston used to do. Now they have Kevin Sumlin as the head coach. Control the pace of the game to keep that offense of Louisiana Tech off the field because they have an explosive offense. And it's great to see Christian Michael back there in the backfield. If this guy is healthy 100% for the whole season, AM would be a problem for opposing teams because this guy is special, has that breakaway speed, also can make you miss and help you out in the passing game. So he's the versatile threat. Good to see him in the backfield. He's going to give that Louisiana Tech defense problems throughout the ball game. Now you look at the Bulldogs. I look at the defensive ends versus those top tackles of Texas AM. If Louisiana Tech is going to have any chance in this ball game, they're going to have to win those battles against guys like Jocko and Matthews. If they can't do so, Texas A&M can have their way on the edges and you have to get pressure on that passing game. And you want to attack vertically early and often versus that secondary of Texas A&M. I think that secondary is a slight question mark for the Aggies coming into this season. And we know Louisiana Tech has an outstanding receiver, outstanding quarterback in Cameron, so they can really throw the football. I would say attack early and often. And if you bend, if you play that bend but don't break defensive approach this year versus a team like Texas A&M, that can get you beat. It, it would actually break this time because A&M will be able to put up points with that Houston style offense. And I'm interested to see, this is an interesting matchup. Contrasting styles, similar offensive type of game plans. The question I have about Louisiana Tech is the running game, can he do enough on the ground? The question I have about AM is can they stop people from throwing the football downfield? This is not the matchup that AM wants. I actually think Louisiana Tech wins this ball game in week one with the passing game, and their defense will cause some issues because I think Louisiana Tech has a very sound secondary to compete with the receiving game of Texas AM. So I look for Louisiana Tech to pull off a stunner week one in Shreveport.